Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more Arumbaville in Banished. <laughs> Somebody made a funny comment that uh, these are the Jews that I've banished from Crusader Kings 2. <laughs> that's, that's funny. You know, you banish the Jews from your land and you send them to, to work here. Now they gotta go really far away now to get this, this stone, which really stinks. But we need stone, so... It is what it is. Do we build more roads? I really feel like we need more roads. Probably should just have the houses all over the place, really. Instead of having a consolidated area, you just build houses everywhere. And then that way they can they can work wherever they, they you know, they, they seem to just freely trade houses. There's no real estate market in this game. They're not like, well, that one has lakefront property, I'll never sell. No, they're just like, oh, you want to work the fishing hut? Totally, sure, let's switch. See, like, this guy... There's one dude living here that works that one, and another person works over there. Why don't you both live there? Are you, there's like three fishers in this house, maybe? Three fishermen. Hmm. Maybe we should just up this one. We got a fisherman and uh, another person there. Yeah, we just need houses everywhere. So from now on, we're going to build with no rhyme or reason. Just build stuff everywhere. Except that little compounds like this, where you've got a, a, a virtuous cycle. The forester plants trees, the forester tends to the trees, the herbalist takes, gets the plants and stuff that grow around the trees, the gatherer gathers whatever, and then the hunter kills all the animals. So I think that those are good little combos. Pretty low on food. Got a got a laborer. El, El Miracle has become an adult, is now working as a laborer. So she can't be very old. Let's find El Miracle. Why isn't El Miracle showing up on my list of laborers? Just said that you're working as a laborer. Game. You silly game. Okay, so we need stone. We also need to get back to gathering. The gathering hut is, like, being useless now. In fact, at the risk of starvation, I'm going to stop us from working the gatherer's hut. And we're going to remove the gatherer's hut and hopefully recover some of the material. I don't know if how much of it we get, but... We need some stone so we can finish the bridge. 14 stone, a few more logs. Just need a tiny bit of stone for these things. 7 stone, that's all it's holding us up. Oh, and the fact that we don't have enough builders, so... These guys are probably on a stone run. Yeah, they're actually just going to pick up stone. God, they're going to go all that way just for stone. Well, since it doesn't cost anything, um, and it does speed up the process, and we are going to go that way in a while, why don't we build some more roads? Some dirt roads, at least. Just like, you know, there's a road. You can use the road. The shift allows it to be the shortest path. I like that. Child was born. We're up to 13 people now. So so far no one's died, but we're out of food. So maybe we knew, need to... Uh, we need more fishing. Fishing should, should keep us going, right? Less building, more fishing. Get some food, men. People. You have gathered some herbs. So that should bring our health back up, right? We have a very healthy, uh, very happy people. We're not very healthy, but we're happy. 
So the forester's lodge. It's much, much slower at generating logs. Hey, we got enough stone to finish the hunting cabin. Yay, we're going to get some venison and leather and stuff. And the gatherer's hut. We can relocate. And it looks like we did get some stone from that. I don't know what percentage, but there's some there. Almost out of clothes, so we'll need a uh, tailor soon. A little bit of everything, aren't we? A child named Hall was born. 20 dudes now. We have no food. And it's early summer. Okay, so definitely no more constructing. Just, like, make food. Food, food, food. So minimalist on most of this stuff. Woodcutter. We have firewood. Let's, let's, uh, well, we need to stock up on firewood, don't we? Shad has become an adult. Good. No one's homeless. There's always that. That's good. Previous season 203. This is just a different swat. Three of four. We have six fishers. This one's not doing nearly as well, probably because they didn't actually work work it as much because it's further away. You need materials. You don't have enough wood. Getting more people in the forester would be, would be good. We, we always need wood, but we always need food. We have no food. What's more important, food or wood? Food. Our health is coming back up. That's great. But the second we gather any food at all, it disappears. like chop down that's that uh, iron no nope. yeah it looks like they're clearing the path in order to build it what'd you just pick up three iron well, that's good though I mean having having the road I think is gonna really speed up travel these distant locations is our bridge done yet nope <laughs> excuse me we have no builders working on it actually nope they're still bringing material over here we we'll get some easy pickings, easy stone. The reserve of stone is low. <laughs> That's exactly why we need stone. 21 people, 21 mouths to feed. Jesus. We need more food. Finish the gatherer's hut. This is our best source of food in the past. Even with all these fish, I, I don't feel like these fish are really being as effective as they could be. That or we just have, we're just eating more and more food. That's the problem. Kentonese become an adult. No, you're not. You're a fisherman. <laughs> we're, just, we're a bunch of fishermen. And gatherers. Please finish this gatherer's hut. Please, please finish it. Hunting cabin has gotten some venison. Good. Venison and leather. We can use the leather to make clothes, I think. Eventually. Finish the gatherer's hut. Okay, so we got two laborers available. Make them into gatherers. And this is part of the problem now. I've got my, my main source of, like, stuff. And then all of the people that live in the town are, like, really far away. So this whole, like, plan of, of houses, I think we're gonna just back out on because I don't, I just, it, it's wrong. We need to be more spread out. So like, a random house here would be good. Maybe you can just stick a random house here. Hi ho, hi ho. Nice work. Looks beautiful. You did a good job. Finish the bridge. 
need logs for the bridge. We're out of bridge. We have no food. No one's starving, though, so that's good. Except we're about to go into winter. These guys have no food. They're gonna die. And we're full up on tools. Excellent. Well, good job on the tools, then. Um, that's a lot of tools that you've made. You've used up all the logs, you bastard. Alright, we do not need a blacksmith anymore. We need people to get food. We need gatherers. Yes, the deer are right there. I see the venison. I see I see the hide. Shoot them. It, there's the hunting cabin right there. Just shoot them. Shoot them all. Slash and burn. We need food. Roots, mushrooms, berries. Current season, you've gathered iron in a forester's lodge. That seems strange. 400 venison. And Isabeth, the child, has died of starvation. That's like, I think, our first death. I'm sad now. Oh, That's not nice. But we do have, uh, Bristania has become an adult. Okay, let's build. Get stuff done. We need to, uh, we need to get over there. We need that stone. And then I think at some point we're gonna need to start making some some of the structures that generate resources. No, we've had more people die. Esteen, the, the builder, has died of starvation. We're starving to death. Uh-oh. Even though I built all of the food stuff and we're trying to make food. What do we... Look at that. We got... Gatherer is food. Fisherman, food. Hunter, food. The only, the only people that aren't working on food are two builders and a couple other people. Which, not many. We just get food. No more foresters, just food. You people eat too much food, that's the problem. That's actually quite a bit of fish. See, we're, we're getting food in. Okay, it's just... Having a better stockpile of food would be nice. A few hundred is not enough. We need, like, ideally a thousand or two thousand, you know? I would like to know what the actual consumption rate is. Like, how much food per person per season or something. And is it different for adults versus children? I think we spent too much, too much of our wood on tools. If I could rebuild this, I'd probably actually make it slightly larger and go house one structure house, one structure, house, structure, house. So make it an, like a 3x3 three three grid so, uh, the center centerpiece that's hollow. Or maybe even an extra house. Maybe five houses. Just a 3x3 three three grid. We'll try that somewhere else. Got all the stone we need here. But we have no trees. So actually that seems to be what's slowing, slowing us up now is no wood. I feel bad. I feel bad about the child. But we're up to 19 people, so we've, we've grown. We started off with just 8 adults, now we have 16. Which is part of the reason why we're so low on food. But look at that, we're actually getting ahead on food in the middle of winter. That's good. That's a good sign. <coughs> we'll do that for a while. We'll get food stored up. No more children will starve to death. That's, that's the vow of Arumbaville. Except for the bad children. Those ones we'll, we'll give anthrax to or something. 
47 to 56. Because you're so close to finishing this, and we can get all this juicy, delicious, good resource. I'd like to build one here as well. The reserve of food is not low. Compared to before, it's overflowing. We have tons of food. We're full of food. So we're probably building up a little bit of leather. Actually... Why isn't leather on this list? Are they just taking the leather and wearing it directly? No, we have 18 leather in here, it's just not considered to be clothes. <coughs> okay, well, can we afford to, to scale back one of our fishermen and maybe go with another builder? Try to get some of this stuff done? Six more logs is all we need. And yes, we do need more firewood, but it's warming up, so... Reserve of food is low. Scary. Somebody needs to pick up that rotting carcass. Get the carcass. Yeah, what, what do you got there? How much food is that? A hundred venison. That's like gonna feed, feed the dead, starving children. Not dead, starving. Almost dead. Nearly dead children. So the Forester's Lodge is, is nice because it doesn't destroy everything, but you get very few logs. Or maybe the problem is we just aren't working at it enough. Let's scale back a builder and go with another Forester. Maybe we can get in, get the builders to do more work if they have the logs that they need. And this thing is actually now in construction, or ready to be constructed, rather. The question is, how do they get to the other side? How do they do that? You know, like... Did you swim across? Seems kind of dangerous. Sixteen dudes, no children. Um, we might be in one of those situations where we... We need more homes to prompt them to start new families. But that's just going to cause more mouths to feed and... It's kind of scary. <coughs> So you get more logs now. Interesting that the iron is generated. Where does the iron come from? Looks like our herbalist did a good job. Onions, roots, mushrooms, and berries. We found a tree to chop down. Excellent. I think the thing I want the most right now is I want to finish some houses that are closer to this. Because having all these people come work all the way down there, especially without having a good road to get there. Let's, um, let's add another road. At the very least, that should speed them up a little bit. You know, it's still not a direct path, but... Hey, the house is being built. Wonderful news. And we have a thousand food. Yay, we're not going to starve. No more children will die. We need more logs. We probably almost have our... Our bridge! Our bridge is done. Yay. Um, so we're going to slash and burn this whole area, aren't we? Or do we want to build another little compound? Maybe a compound over here would be better. But we do want the stone, so let's at least take that. So we'll take the stone and the iron. And I guess let's also take some of these trees. We just, just chop these trees down up here. And then we'll build a compound in this area with another bridge somewhere over here. 
And there's also room for another compound up here. so glad that we're not dying. These people are probably unhappy because I, I let the children die. It happens. Let's see who moves in. I'm curious to see that, like, right away. Immediately, Kentery and Monia. One of which is going to work the uh, this thing, and the other person is going to work on building. So, okay, I'm going to take a break here. Thank you for watching, everyone. See you again soon.